the code block in the Gutenberg editor allows you to present your source code any any kind of code to the readers that they can view and copy for example uh, when I write tutorials uh, to Gutenberg hub I mostly need uh, to present to provide the code which the users can read and copy like this so this is done by the code block in the Gutenberg editor so let's find out how the code block works and how to use it to add a code block you can do it in different ways same as any other Gutenberg block either click on the plus icon at the top and search for the code block and click it to insert it it gives you this option uh, this blank uh, div uh, where you can insert or write your own code so let's see if we have some code here in our editor or from online I can simply copy that and paste it here and it displays like this in the editor that's it this is how you can add it and use it so let me show you another way to add a code block uh, or in fact any other block so you can click uh, click on this plus icon or either type forward slash in an empty paragraph and type code code and it gives you the two options basically one is short code which is a different block and this one is what we are covering here in this video so it's the same way you can paste your code here as well so this art works this is really a simple and minimal block with uh, almost no options in the block toolbar only one option is available which is the transform option the transform option allows you to convert a block to other block type so for the code block we have three options one is group this will simply enclose this into a group inside a group block and the one is custom html and then preformatted so that makes sense if you if i convert it to a custom html so it will look like this so basically it won't allow users to base, uh, to copy the code it will basically render the output of this on the front end like this so not useful in in the case where you need to present the code to be copyable or readable so the only way is using the code block and the one is option you can transform to is proof preformatted so preformatted uh, is again for a different purpose uh, and not suitable for the case where you need to present the code so anyway these are the options in the block toolbar for the code block and in the sidebar we have no additional option besides the advanced panel which is a standard for almost all the Gutenberg blocks where you can assign a CSS class or an HTML anchor so besides that there is not much more uh, options available for the code block by default hope I've covered everything for the code block. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. Thank you.